multiplication of a fraction by a whole number. Hello children, today let us learn a new topic, multiplication of a fraction by a whole number. Look at this rectangle. It is divided into eight equal parts. That means each part is one-eighth of the rectangle. Now, let us find out what part of the rectangle is shaded. Here, the number of shaded parts are three. Hence, the total shaded part is one-eighth plus one-eighth plus one-eighth. This is the addition statement. Also, as there are three shaded parts, each being one-eighth of the rectangle, so we can say that the total shaded part is equal to three times one-eighth, which is equal to three into one-eighth. This is the multiplication statement. Thus, putting all statements together, we write it as one-eighth plus one-eighth plus one-eighth is equal to three times one-eighth is equal to three upon eight. Therefore, the whole number into numerator upon denominator will give us the answer. Thus, three into one-eighth is equal to three upon eight. Thus, three upon eight is the fraction for the shaded part. Kids, remember, one, the product of a fraction and one is always the fraction. Two, the product of a fraction and zero is always zero. Now, let us solve one story problem. Minnie eats five upon four chocolates every day. How many chocolates does she eat in three days? So, we write the statements as Every day, Minnie eats 5 upon 4 chocolates. Total number of days is equal to 3 days. Total number of chocolates that she eats in 3 days is equal to 3 into 5 upon 4. So, to find the answer, we use the formula whole number into numerator upon denominator. Therefore, 3 into 5 upon 4 is equal to 15 upon 4. Thus, Minnie eats 15 upon 4 chocolates in 3 days. Wasn't it easy solving multiplication of a fraction by a whole number?